Hey everybody, how's it going? I'm Alejandro Perez, the CGI Nerd, and in this video we're going to be going over how to change the default color and shape of a node inside of Houdini in case you want to be able to organize and adjust some things in here. So this is going to be a quick tip and uh, let's get started. So uh, I'm just going to create a geometry node um, and we can do it out in the object level or really any level or we can jump in into um, the sub level so we're in the soft operators or the geometry node here um, so um, let's look at it over here basically these are the two buttons we're going to be focusing on we can see the shortcut for the color is just C and then the shape palette is Z so um, if I push Z here, you'll see that we get all the different shape options that we have for the um, node. So we can drag and drop that on there. Um, and right now, if you just drag and drop it like that, if I were to create another geometry node, it's still going to come back out as the normal shape. Let's say we wanted to create that as a default. So let's start it from scratch. We have a geometry node and we want that to be the default. We're going to hold down control, click and drag. And then now whenever we create another geometry node, it comes in in that shape. And then uh, the same thing is true for the color. So if we want geometry to be green, we can control drag on that. Now, when we create a geometry node, it's always going to be that green color. If we want to bring it back to normal, I'm um, going to hold down. Let me undo that. Um, I'm going to just hold down control because I didn't do that on control the last time. So if I hold down control, you'll see that it switches them all over. And then let's go to Z and we want the default. We go back to the default shape, which is that first shape there. And that's how you adjust it. Um, a lot of times, like if I want to be able to get the um, out nodes, so a lot of times I'll create uh, null nodes and um, we have this X shape here for the null. Um, sometimes it's kind of nice to be able to change it into a different shape that isn't um, this shape if you wanted to. So this is going to be like my out geo, for example. I can do control drag over here. And then I can change the color to like a red color. So whenever I am going to an out geo, or creating a null node, you'll see that it's going to be creating that and that would be kind of where I am sending information out. So that way it's easy to spot and find when you're creating something. Um, so switching it back, uh, going back to Z and then control drag over here. See if I change the color, I might not have done it with um, the control. So I'm gonna just double check it by creating a null node and it looks like it did. Perfect. Oops. Okay. So that is it for this quick tip. I hope you guys found it useful. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.